Hello friends subscribe to our channel GDC and press the bell icon for more updates. Hello Pharma aspirants, welcome or welcome back to GDC channel. In this video, we will be going to learn about the mechanism of action of treatment of cough. Cough is defined as the a sudden forceful hacking sound to release air and clear and irritation in the throat or airway. Coughing can have causes that aren't due to the underlying diseases. Example includes normal clearing of airway irritants such as smoke or gas, tobacco use and improperly swelling food and liquids. So the drugs of class which are covered are first one is pharyngeal demulcent. The drugs which are used as pharyngeal demulcent are lozenges, syrups, Glycerin, and licorice. The pharyngeal demulcent soothes the throat and reduces the afferent impulse from the inflamed or irritated pharyngeal mucosa. Thus, it provides the symptomatic relief in the dry cough arising from the throat. Another class of drugs used in treatment of cough is antitussive. The first one is opioids such as codeine or folocodine, folcodine. These opioids depresses the cough reflex in the medulla. Non-opioids, dextromethorphan. Dextromethorphan. It is a synthetic central NMDA receptor antagonist. Next drugs are noscapine and clofadinol. Clofadinol. These drugs represses the cough reflex in medulla, just like opioid drugs. Some other drugs are prenoxdiazine, this drug depresses the peripheral cough reflex and acts as periphery, peripherally desensitizing the pulmonary stretch receptor and reduces the tussle impulse originating in the lungs. Antihistaminics H1 receptor antagonist. These drugs relieve the cough of their sedative and anticholinergic effect but it lacks the expectorant properties. Third class of drugs which is expectorant. First one is secretion enhancer, which is a direct stimulant. This is the guafenicine. Guafenicine increases the respiratory secretion by directly stimulating the bronchial glands. Reflux stimulant, ammonium chloride. Ammonium Chloride. It increases the respiratory secretion by stimulating the gastric reflux. Mucolytic accents is of promhexine and ambroxol. Bromohexine and ambroxol. These drugs is capable of inducing thin copious bronchial secretion and depolymerization of mucopolysaccharides 
directly as well as by liberating the lysozymal enzymes. Next is acetylcysteine. Acetyl cysteine. This drug is the mechanism of action having mucopolysaccharide network of fibers in tenacious sputum is broken by acetylcysteine. Next drug is carbocysteine. Carbocysteine acts by breaking the disulfide bond of mucoproteins present in the sputum and makes the makes it less viscous or viscid. Also, the drug carbocysteine liquefies the viscid sputum in the same way as acetylcysteine. Next class of drug is adjuvant antidepressive bronchodilators. Solbutamol. Solmetrol, Bambutrol, Formetrol, Ephedrine, Terbutaline. These drugs have agonist action on the beta-2 receptor, cause the activation of adenyl cyclase and increases the intracellular travel of CGMP in bronchial muscle cell, which causes the relaxation. That's all for the drugs which are used in the treatment of cough. Thank you for watching this video. Have a nice day.